A celebration of Gullah Geechee culture today to honor those who made the advancement of African Americans possible. News 2's Kevon Dupree joins us live from North Charleston. Kevon, you got to witness some of the traditions that started right here in the Low Country. That's right, Amir. So I'm here on the grounds of Mount Moriah Baptist Church in North Charleston, where organi organizers, excuse me, celebrated Gullah Geechee culture. That culture started here in the Low Country in the 1500s. The International African American Museum celebrating a culture more than 500 years old. This is one of our signature programs that we just want to make sure the culture right here in the, the, the corridor, the South Carolina, North Carolina, Georgia, and Florida, that it gets remembered. The awakening of the ancestors through music, Gullah Geechee homecoming event, meant to honor ancestors who lived in the low country centuries ago. Gullah Geechee people really are um, descendants of enslaved Africans who were brought over here during the transatlantic slave trade. Um, these people were resilient and they created a whole new language, culture, food and identity that still remains prevalent in the Charleston low country. The evening was highlighted by Gullah Geechee songs, which organizers say influenced the music we enjoy today. There's always a sense of, of spirit and a sense of a movement and rejoicing, despite what's happening to us, still a joy. Performers say they take pride in sharing their culture with the world. Everyone, and I do mean everyone that you see in this group, is a part of the Gullah Geechee culture. We have traced our ancestors five to seven generations. So we're not just cultural art performers. This is our culture. They look to educate others so the culture is never forgotten. It's who we are. We were birthed into it. We can't help it. We say things like, come here, this show, that day, and we're proud of it. And also look to honor their ancestors. We're building this International African American Museum on the very land and soil where our ancestors stepped foot on the ground. So our building is raised up 13 feet simply because we want to pay respect to the land. Now, if you weren't able to attend this evening's event, you can go to the International African American Museum website and view the live stream playback. Reporting in North Charleston, Kevon Dupree, Count On 2.